So a tough decision is not, okay, we're going to have to lay off 10% of our workforce to make, to make our arbitrary projections or to maintain profitability. We'll make less money, but we'd like to make more money. So I'm going to have to make that tough decision. That's actually a very, that's not a tough decision. That's, that's a pretty cowardly decision. A tough decision is, okay, we're going to take a major hit because we're going to do right by our people and see them through this hard time because it's the right thing to do for the long term and it's the right thing to do for our people. Like that, Mary May Willer. That's hard. It's a really tough decision to say, I'm going to get completely hammered by Wall Street or the press for doing this because they won't like their returns, but it's the right thing to do. That's a really hard decision. In fact, you know what's a really hard decision? Saying, oh my God, the board may fire me for doing this. That's a really hard decision. So, you know, just because it's going to hurt a lot of people doesn't make it a difficult decision. What makes a hard decision is doing the right thing in the face of unbelievable, adver unbelievable adversity and overwhelming pressure. And it goes back to empathy, I guess. And it goes back to empathy. You know, and, and at the end of the day, you know, the, the number of companies that make hard decisions for short-term gains is funny to me because all that does is put you in good shape for the short term, mm -hmm. you know? You know, I, I love I love meeting companies where I'm like, what's your priority? They're like, oh, we're, we're building a culture of innovation. And yet they've had layoffs, you know, for the past three years, every single year. I'm like, how's that innovation working out for you? Because you do realize that innovation requires experimentation. Experimentation requires failure. And if you're going to put people on a short list for layoffs every single year, who's exactly going to take a risk to try something new? Yeah, that's what I thought, you know? So people tend to keep their head down and stay under the radar if that's the culture of the company. So the the, the funny thing is is like is like everybody knows this. It's like it's like I'm I'm saying something magical that nobody's ever heard before. It's like everybody knows this to be true, and yet people don't do it. That's why I talk about the importance of courage.